Imagine if we all humans had only one toe in our feet to walk? How do you think it would be possible for us to carry our whole weight on just one single toe? I am sure we cannot imagine this happening. But then suddenly this animal came forward and did it like it was a walk in the park. And that animal was none other than the horse. Yes, you heard it right. The strong feet that you see the horses galloping on are not its whole feet but instead only its central toe. As other toes became vestige Allen fuse as a part of their evolution, it all began 60 million years ago with the Ohippus, a small multi-fingered forest dweller whose feet were suited for maneuvering through dense vegetation. As the climate and landscapes changed, 40 million years ago Miso Hippus appeared, still retaining multiple toes but beginning to adapt to more open environments. The turning point in equine evolution came with Marichippus, which appeared 30 million years ago and exhibited a lengthening of the central toe and a gradual reduction of the side toes, setting the stage for improved speed and efficiency on expanding grasslands. Finally, with Pliohippus, the evolution reached a climax as single dominant toe evolved, encased in a tough hoof perfectly tuned for swift, long distance running in open terrains. In essence, the shift to a single-toed foot was nature's ingenious response to new environmental challenges, favoring the streamlined design that defines the modern horse today.